Welcome back everyone. You may be in a position where you actually cannot figure out how to sync up your Joy-Con to your Nintendo Switch. So you basically typically connect them by sliding them right into their port. So you can see right here, you basically just take your Joy-Con and typically slide it in just like this. And usually when you go ahead and turn on your Joy-Con, it'll go ahead or when you turn on your Switch, it'll go ahead and turn on your specific Joy-Cons as well and charge them. But sometimes that doesn't necessarily happen. So the first thing you wanna do is determine whether both Joy-Cons are connecting or not. If you find out that one Joy-Con is actually working, let's say the left one is working, but the right one is not working for some reason, well in that case, maybe the right one does have a problem of some sort. So what I would recommend doing is actually disconnecting the right one. Let's say this one is the broken one, disconnecting it and looking right into the track of the Nintendo Switch. Sometimes there are issues where there's a bunch of dirt and debris kind of, you know, stored in this specific area. So getting some type of cotton swab or something and cleaning this little portion out will actually end up fixing this, you know, and I think sometimes that can be the problem. However, I think that is few and far between. But if you had your switch for a while, cleaning out this portion and then cleaning out this portion sometimes may actually end up fixing the issue. Now the next thing is, is that if you're actually able to go ahead and get the Nintendo Switch actually turning on and by using it in one specific Joy-Con, what, what Nintendo actually recommends doing is updating your Nintendo Switch to the latest version of software. So that's the very next thing I'd recommend doing is make sure your Nintendo Switch is up to date on one of the more recent versions of software. That way you can actually go ahead and guarantee that your specific Nintendo Switch will actually go ahead and you know, be up to date. Now the next thing Nintendo actually recommends doing is going back onto your Joy-Con itself, just like right here, and there's a sync button. So right here, there's a little sync button. Now these Joy-Cons are dead, so I probably should have charged them, but you wanna go ahead and click this little Joy-Con little button once, and you'll see that sometimes there will be some buttons or some lights that come up. And then once you do that, you want to go ahead and take back your Nintendo Switch and go ahead and just re-plug it in. So re-slide it in just like this, and make sure that you can go ahead and get it connected. And typically, this will end up connecting and working. Sometimes, like I said before, there may be some issues, but if you're having issues where the Joy-Cons aren't charging, that's a whole separate issue, but if they're not connecting in the first place, that's typically how to fix it, and those are typically what I've seen happen. Most of the time, it's both Joy-Cons not working, and that usually means there's a software update that you need to install for your Switch. But if it's typically just one Joy-Con that's working and one not, that typically means that, you know, that specific Joy-Con that's not working does have a problem that probably ends up needing to be fixed before you actually go ahead and use it. So that's probably just a couple things that I would recommend and exactly how to fix it. Again, if you just bought these brand new or something and they're not connecting, then recommend returning them and getting ones that do work. So that really pretty much covers it up. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really discount, so it means so much if you guys get hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my other channels. More importantly than everything else, every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.